What size furnace do I need? You know what they say about the size of a man's furnace. It needs to be precisely matched to their home for maximum efficiency, of course. So how do you know what size furnace you need? First, you need to know how furnaces are sized. They aren't just like the gas station cups, small, medium, and jumbo. Furnaces are rated by their output in British thermal units or BTUs. The bigger the number, the more heat you get. Typically, residential furnaces range between 40,000 and 120,000 BTUs. Efficiency furnaces also have a rating based on their average fuel utilization efficiency or AFUE. Furnaces that use less energy to produce heat have a score closer to 100%. Most modern furnaces start at 80% and can get up to 97%. Home size determines furnace size. The size of your home is the biggest factor for which size furnace you need. It's got to be big enough to heat everywhere without overworking and breaking down within five years. It's recommended that your furnace has 30 to 60 BTUs per square foot, depending on the climate where you live. What else affects the furnace's effectiveness? Aside from total square footage, here are five factors that you need to think about when shopping for a furnace. Climate. The first and most impactful of these factors is the climate you live in. If you live in the heart of the African savanna, you probably are going to need a different furnace than if you're in Portland. That being said, even in the same state, you'll need a larger or smaller furnace just based on the local climate. Insulation. A furnace pumps heat into your home, but insulation keeps that heat in. Have you had anything happen that could have damaged your insulation? Like water damage? Do you have a really old home? Certain rooms that aren't insulated at all? Be sure to talk about this stuff with an HVAC pro. Then they will be able to tell you exactly how much money you're spending to keep those buns nice and toasty. What direction your windows face? Your home will naturally be warmer if it gets more sun exposure. If you have more windows facing south, your house will be warmer than another house that faces north or has fewer windows. Efficiency. While the efficiency of your furnace may not have direct impact on the heating it provides, it will impact how much energy it uses. You'll want to keep this in mind if your home requires a lot of heating. This will save you a ton of money on your energy bill. Layout. Think about whether your home has an open design or has a lot of small rooms and corners that can trap heat. If there are open connections between rooms, this will help keep heating even throughout your house. What happens when a furnace is the wrong size? Let's talk about why having the right size furnace is important. Here are some signs and symptoms if your furnace is too small. It runs on super long cycles. Heating throughout your home is uneven. The furnace breaks down more often than it should, or parts don't last their full lifetime. And the energy bill is too high. If your furnace is too big, it'll run in short bursts. On, off, on, off, on, off. This causes it to use more energy than normal, costing you more in energy bills. It'll make certain rooms hotter than you want them to be, and the furnace will have a shorter lifespan. How to find the right size furnace. Galileo once said, Mathematics is the language in which God has written the universe. And we agree. To accurately calculate the number of BTUs your home requires, an HVAC sales professional will input a bunch of data about your home into one unified formula. These are called manual J or block load calculations. So now you know that getting the right size furnace for your home is super important. We're your local HVAC experts out of Salem, Oregon. If you have other questions about HVAC systems, check out our other videos. To learn more about who we are and how we can help you, visit Advantage LLC and follow us on social media. We're here when you need us.